الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم ما بعد أيها الحبة في الله. The holy month of Ramadan is the month of the Quran. Is a month when the Quran was revealed, and from the adab or adab of the holy month of Ramadan is reading the Quran and being active in contemplating and reciting the Quran and understanding its meanings. So, with that in mind, I felt that it would be beneficial for us to go over some basic fawa'id and basic tafsir of Surah Al-Fatiha and whatever we're able to do during this holy month. And before we begin, and we'll take our time and go through and just gain some benefits from some of the ulama, like some of the contemporary scholars and possibly some of the tafsir or the salaf. Uh, we know that the holy month of Ramadan, we should benefit from this time and worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as the shayateen are locked up. And it's a time to face yourself, to look and hasb al nafs, to hold yourself accountable. Contemplate on how you've been living and how you've been practicing your deen. Have you been doing what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wants from you? That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created us for ibadah. Are you fulfilling that? And what shortcomings do you have? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, I have not created mankind in the jinn except for the purpose of worshipping me. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has made Ramadan fard, wajib, upon us, that we must fast if we're able to do so. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, kitab al kareem kutiba alaykum siyam kama kutiba ladina min qablakum la'alakum tattakoon. Kutiba alaykum siyam. Allah, ha, uh, fasting is prescribed for you. Similar to the way it was prescribed for those who preceded you. La'allakum tattakoon. In order that you would gain taqwa. So fasting is a wasila, it's a means to gaining taqwa. And taqwa, habita fillah, is enjoining the commandments of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and avoiding his prohibitions. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Fikitab al Kareem, with regards to the Quran and the month of Ramadan, Qala subhana, Shar Ramadan, Alladi unzila fihi al Quran, Hudan lin nas, wa bayyanatim min al Huda wa furqan. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, The month of Ramadan is the month which the Qur'an was revealed as a guidance for mankind. Hudan lin nas wa bayinat min al huda wa furqan. And, and something to, to clarify the guidance and, and give a furqan, a criterion. So the Qur'an is that furqan between truth and falsehood. And it is something that clarifies guidance, and it is guidance. Hudin lil muttaqeen. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Alif lam meem, thalik al kitab la rayba fi. Hudin lil muttaqeen. That is the book in which there is no doubt. As, and it's a guidance for mankind. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Fi kitab al kareem. Ya yun nas kaja akum burhan mirabbikum wa anzalna ilaykum nurum mubina. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, O oh, you mankind, again addressing mankind. The burhan, you know, the proof, or the, the proof has been, has come to you from your Lord. And we have revealed it to you. Light, with a clear light. Nurun Mubin. This is something that lights up the pathway. It gives guidance. This is the, the Quran. 
And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil and bless us to be something for us and not against us. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala Muhammad.